Love to here back again with another video. So this video was something that someone asked me to make and this is how to get your MUNAN set up or your EU MMC set up. So this guide is pretty simple. It shouldn't take too long, but there are a few risks of running a SysNAN just off the bat like that. And some of those issues that are it is easy to get banned and it is easy to mess up your switch and brick it. So if you don't know what you're doing, you have such a high risk of breaking your switch if you're running your SysNAN or just getting banned off your switch if you use your system NAND. And that's something that you might want to look out for. The benefit of an emu NAND is it's just emulating your LAN like that. So it is something that is recommended. You know, the benefits is you don't get a ban on that as long as you stay offline from Nintendo. So if you have your Wi-Fi off, you're safe. And it's a safe area to do test, you know, dangerous or risky mods and homebrew. And there's no chance of breaking your console or losing, you know, unique stuff that are on your Switch. So that's one thing that you want to keep in mind. So in order to do this, we do need to fully power up our Switch and we do need to take our SD card of our Switch. So let's do that real quick and I'm going to show you what to do on the computer. So here we are on our PC. As you can see, this is my Switch SD over here and there's a lot of stuff here. But what we're going to need to do is make a folder and then we're going to name this Switch SD. And then what we're going to do is make a backup of this whole thing. So we're just going to copy this over and we're going to paste this here. And then this thing is going to take a minute to do, but let this do its thing. And once this is done, we're going to eject our Switch and then I'll show you what to do from there. So we're going to, once it's done, Take the SD card, plug in your Switch, and I'll show you what to do from there. So here we are back on the Nintendo Switch. I can't use my capture card for this, but it should be pretty easy. What we're going to go over here is we're going to go here, and then we're going to look for tools. So where is tools? So now we are on tools over here, and we're going to go into partition SD card. We're going to press OK, and then we're going to go in EU MMC, and then we're going to drag this to... 29 so where is it so 29 full you want to make it 29 full then what you want to do is you want to go next step and press this you want to press start and that's pretty much it so we're going to wait for this to finish and i'll show you what to do from there now that this is done what we're going to do is press ok and what this did is just clear every single file on your switch except the necessities that's why we made a backup in the beginning because we had to wipe this what we're going to do is press close and then we're going to go home and now you're going to see we have mu mmc here so we're going to press this create mu mmc sd partition part one and it's going to take a while so we're going to wait and once this is done i'll get back to you and show you what to do from there so here we are, we're back. This thing took me 24 minutes to finish. So as you can see, it's 100% and it's just finished. So we're gonna press close and we're gonna go and change EU MMC. Then we're gonna go into SD raw one and then we're gonna press okay. And then we're good. Now, before we load it into it, we're gonna go into tools and then we're gonna go on partition, not partition. We're gonna go on USB tools. And then you wanna connect your computer using the USB-C cable. So we're gonna go on SD card and then connect your switch via USB-C and I'll go on the computer and show you what to do from there. So here we are back on our switch. Once it's done, you want to press close and then close here. We're going to go home and emu MMC and that's pretty much it. So let me show you how to launch it. We're going to go on launch and then you're going to see that you have all this here. CFW, EU, MU, MMC, you're going to have some here, but you're going to go here and click this and you're going to wait. So it's going to take a second for it to boot. Give it a second. And it's, I think that's taking longer because it's the first time, but there we go. It's booted up and everything works. We go in system settings. Then we're gonna go on to system just to verify it's there. And now if you see an E there like this, that's how you know it worked. As you can see, it says E there. So if there's an E there, that means you're on MUMC. I hope that this video helped you. And if you have any questions, join the Discord and yeah, goodbye. So here we are back on the computer and you're gonna to need to go to this website. But to get to this website, I'll put the link in the description down below. When you're in this website, you wanna go down and then you wanna scroll down until you can click on to this one right here where it says DNS, you just wanna download eummc.txt. So we're gonna download that.
After that, what you want to do is you want to open your switch into a new window like this. And we're going to go on our switch SD card here. And we're just going to copy all this over here. Drag and drop it here. It's going to take a minute. The next thing you want to do is make a new folder called hosts. So we're going to name it host real quick. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go get that file we just downloaded, which is the EU MMC. And we're just going to drag and drop it into hosts. So there's still a little bit more we have to do. So what we're going to do is we are going to go to our SD card once everything's transferred. We're going to look for a Nintendo folder. We're going to highlight it. Then we're going to copy it. So where is copy? Then we're going to go into MUMMC. Then we're going to go into raw one. And then we're just going to paste the folder in here. Once this is done, eject the SD card and we're going to switch and I'll show you what to do from there.